Hello, welcome back. We're doing Knock Knock. Never even knew that this quest was part of the quest chain, but obviously it is. House Wolf seeks to claim territory, as fallen always do. Brute force, no mercy. Cabal are soldiers, trained for war, very good at war. This time, I think, Skolos's crew have met their match. We'll see. A walker? Where do they find these things? Guardian, stay out of the crossfire. And good luck. Say, stay out of the crossfire. Seriously, that was it? <laughs> oh, 
Okay then. Walker did not see that coming. Not deploy precious tech without direction. Have found leader of Reborn House. They hunt it down. We'll find new leader of House Prime Servitor. Follow the Prime's path. Of time. I knew it leads to that one. Okay, Prime's path is basically a revamp of the Garden Spy mission. Only you take out something else at the end. But it is almost frame for frame identical to uh, that. Pretty much frame for frame identical to that. Only difference, you do something different. So we're doing that because that was a surprisingly short mission. And this isn't. So... Was looking, searching for new wolf kelm. Could not find one. Could not understand house wolves' tactics. Bad tactics. Fight cabal? Could not find new Kel because there is no Kel. House Wolves follows a new god, a servitor, a prime. This a pilgrimage guardian. And for faith, they will stop at nothing. Cool. Only one place the prime can be. Only one place shrouded to sensors, hidden to tracking. Vex Confluence, deep in Cabal Base.
nice and easy. Ah. Normally for fighting the Fallen I would choose um, Striker. But As best we can tell, the wolves managed to slip past the base's outer defenses and set up a perimeter around the confluence. Even the Cabal are having trouble prying them out of there. Yeah, because it's a single place. Um, but the survivability of the Sunbreaker is just better. Take you out in a minute, don't worry. Hopefully this time for good. 
Hopefully. Right, so now we go back to Varix, and that completes that quest. And hopefully, because we've already done the Lost and Found quest, I get the boot in Gemini. But I may need to rank up with Petra if I don't. If it doesn't drop, that means that I do need to rank up with her to rank 3, I believe. Which, to be honest, should not take too long because her bounties are worth a lot. So, there's that. Uh, the other bounties are relative, or the quest, uh, quest from Petra is relatively easy. Basically, go to the Court of Vorix and kill shit, but it's easy. More often than not, you'll be doing the Court of Vorix quest anyway to get your artifact or whatever. I'll level up that way. As I said, I'm only just doing this to clear up quests to get them out of the way. Because I'm bound to be not the only one that's got all of these quests ready to go. And uh, just left them by the by just to do the daily stuff, do the strikes, enjoy playing the game, meet up with new people and all that sort of stuff. And now that you've got the Rise of Iron approaching fast, we got to get this stuff done and out of the way so we can get to the new stuff when that, when that drops. So that's pretty much what I'm aiming for. To be able to level up and rank up. I can't wait for the next Iron Banner though. And the thing that I really am looking forward to, Radiant Engrams. Uh, being able, or oh, sorry, Iron Engrams. Being able to purchase uh, the previous, um, so it would be year one, completely vanilla game, Iron Banner gear. Um, year two, uh, so that would be not not Taken King. Um, oh God, what, what would it be? It, um, not year two, House of Wolves, Iron Banner gear. So the change in Iron Banner gear. Uh, not only that, being able to purchase the Iron Banner marks, the old Iron Banner. Emblems. Can't tell you how much it's bugged me that I don't have the green emblem. But at the time that Iron Banner was rolling around last time, we'll continue to track bullets. <laughs> we'll know if wolves rise again. I didn't have the um, Vex Mythoclast, and that that was running all. You know how long I've wanted that, and um, that was offered. As a Titan, thank you, Guardian. Oh, feud of fading too. Your friend, Varix. <laughs> Your friend Petra. Yes. So we get uh, feud on fading, which I've been looking for. Um, which is not a very good shader at the end of it. Yeah. But. The thing that I've really been looking for is that. I wanted that um, when uh, the Queen's Wrath first came around, uh, came around and I missed it. But now that I've got that and you can complete these quests relatively easily. You'll be able to get the uh, mark for your class at a higher level. I, if you like the Queen's Wrath uh, look, I highly advise you to do that because it's very, very cool. Um, let's do that. Yes, I don't have much of the new gear. That's fine. Uh, do that. Do that. We do that. We do that. That really is kind of cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, definitely, 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 definitely keeping that. As it's too cool for school. Let's crack open the egg grab and just dismantle it straight away because it's going to be useless anyway. I've learned much in the defeat. This horrible robot. Told you. Mark of the Lost Seven, two eighty four. Not completely useless. Actually, if you have the ability 
don't do it. And you have any regularly vended stuff, come to Varix. With a legendary engram and enough glimmer to do it, buy one of those and you can automatically get a 310 mark. Which is a good leg up. That's definitely what I'm going to be doing when it comes around to um, Rise of Iron, if I've got one that's um, missing. So, yeah, that's that. Now it is, that is actually the case. We need to rank up with Petra. Will that give us any... No, there's... Fight, fight with fight. Okay. So, barring anything else that I'm completely unaware of, other than the Echoes of Oryx quest, which hasn't completed, even though I've actually done it. Um, I believe that's it. So, as far as I'm aware, other than a couple of things which won't take long, that, that is perhaps one of the easiest to do. Um, it's, it's done, pretty much. I would say if you need Path of the, Path of the Defender, Omnigal, the Omnigal Strike is definitely going to be the, your friend doing that one, for sure. Um, Get some guards over to the prison of elders. So, Make sure yeah. None of their okay. <laughs> Almost lost a plane. <laughs> anyway, I will catch you next time uh, with potentially more Destiny Taken King stuff. Uh, rounding off a couple of the quests, doing the uh, mark, bond, and cloak items for the other other classes. So it's just going to get me the um, other uh, class item mark for the Taken King when when that first came came out. If you are unaware of how to go about getting the uh, class items. I'm going to be finishing those off for the Path of the Defender quest, which to be honest has been on my list for almost a year now. Uh, and a couple of other things, but essentially, barring any major screw ups with anything that I've missed, Taken King's finished. Moving on to Rise of Iron soon. Catch you next time with more other things. It's nice to actually say that I've actually completed Destiny Taken King. Aside from that Echoes of Voids quest, that's bugging me. So yeah, catch you next time. Bye.